Becca McCall and I'm the Director of Annual Giving Programs here at Roberts. And I am here today to tell you about our Day of Giving coming up on March 24th. Um, hopefully this sounds familiar to some of you. It's a day that we have every year. Um, we set, a set aside 24 hours where we try and raise as much money as we can for you, for our students. Um, whether you know it or not, Many of you are here today because of the financial support of alumni and friends of the college. Last year they gave over $1.5 million that helps support you with your scholarships, your programs, your activities, which make your education possible. So we wanna celebrate that and we want you to be part of that day with us. One way you can get involved is by sharing our video that we're going to be posting that day on social media. You can go to the Roberts social media pages and share that video. Maybe you wanna put in there about how Roberts has made an impact on your life and how you're grateful for the scholarships and support that you have received while you're here. Maybe you could take it one step further and you ask your family or your friends to make a gift that day. Or you can get involved in a trivia competition we're having that day, March 24th at noon. Um, this is going to be a competition between our student experience funds that are listed here on the screen. Um, so if you're part or of any of these groups or participate in any of these things, you might care to join us that day because this, the fund or the team that wins trivia gets $500 towards their fund and the fund or the team that has the most attendance gets $500 for their fund. So we'd love to have you join us. You can go to roberts.edu slash trivia competition to check that out. We hope one way or another you'll join us that day um, and celebrate how Roberts alumni and friends are making a difference in your life every day. What's going on everybody? We just wanted to give a quick update of a new student group that we have on campus. So my name is Isaiah Lewis. I am currently um, a graduate student. I am one of the student assistants to the diversity and equity programs here at Roberts Wesleyan. Um, and joining me is... Um, my name is Abu Gavane. Um, I'm a sophomore, computer science major. My name is Casey Viator. I am a junior history and Spanish major. My name is Justine Sharda. I am a business administration and marketing major. And so these are just a few of our members of SAID. And what SAID stands for is Student Ambassadors of Diversity and Equity. And so essentially, um, this is a student group that the Office of Diversity and Equity decided to implement this year um, as a way for students to have a voice on campus. So again, these are three of the 12 members that we have. Um, so we're just gonna jump in real quick with it, um, explain what, who we are, what we do, um, and why this is important for our campus to have a group like this. So Casey, I'll start with you. Um, just kind of give a little brief overview of what SAID is um, and kind of what we're gonna be doing this year and beyond. Right, of course. So SAID is a group on campus that is essentially the voice for the students to talk about topics related to diversity. And we meet with the Office of Diversity and Equity mm -hmm. at least once a month and we talk about measures or plans that we would like implemented on campus to just bring this overall better positive vibe to campus. Yeah, absolutely. So um, Casey did a great job of kind of summing it up. It's a student group that is a voice for the students on campus, so things that we want to see implemented and changed. So thanks for that, Casey. So Justine, I'll throw it over to you. <laughs> Just kind of talk a little bit about, we've had a couple meetings already, yeah. um, what those have been like, what are the things that we've talked about, and, and all that kind of stuff. For sure. So we've had two meetings so far, and a bunch of the meetings have been just focusing on kind of meeting each other and um, getting to know each other um, off the bat and then kind of diving into what we can do to better the campus and kind of implement real change um, and take action on campus. So we've been in uh, two Zoom meetings and we've done a bunch of different things um, in breakout rooms, kind of finalizing and seeing what can we do, what events can we kind of support the students and how to kind of make this 
um, COVID semester a really good one and to implement real change. Yeah, absolutely. And so, um, like Justine was saying, there's things that we want to actually see happen. This isn't a group that uh, we meet and talk about things and then we leave it at that. These are things that um, myself, along with the other student assistant to the diversity and equity programs and our chief diversity officer, uh, we're talking about these things and seeing how can we um, put these plans into action. So here is the rest of our team that makes up um, the student ambassadors of diversity and equity. And so the last question, Abu, I'll direct this one to you, is just seeing um, the meeting so far and seeing the people that are in it, there, there's a lot of different um, backgrounds, a lot of different ethnicities. How does that play into um, our campus being more diverse and how is that a positive um, makeup of our students in SAIDE? Um. When you have a group like Sage, Sage um, with multiple uh, people from different backgrounds, different parts of the world, it like brings um, basically a voice for everyone on campus. Um, it brings it brings people together with different perspective, different mindsets, and basically give um, a campus a better overview. So. Mm, yeah, absolutely, and that was one of the aims too in um, creating this. Uh, program is so that people um, have a voice from all areas and that there's not people that feel left out and just because I may come from a different country, I'm an international student or maybe I'm of a different religion than um, Christianity, that they feel left out and they don't have a voice. And so uh, we just wanted to give you guys a quick synopsis on what SAID is, uh, let you know that this is a newer program that we have implemented um, and that we are really excited to be able to advocate for the students. Um, and to be able to be a voice for students on campus. So be on the lookout for SAID um, and different events coming your guys' way this semester and semesters beyond.